Jugush after three years with the bus atakuwa ame make around 2 million na Jugush age by taxi after three years Jugush age kuwa ame make 5.5 million so Jugush nitafute nitafute surely this was a small mistake but you can redeem yourself in the next investment look for me Um, I know all of you guys have seen these stories that are circulating online that Jugush, ama Jugona, ama Jugush, ame buy, ame buy bus, that two-seater, na kaiweka super metro. And a lot of people have been asking questions, what opportunity did Jugush see? Or is it that he was not well informed in that investment because it's a huge investment of money that he committed to buying that bus? which I will give you a breakdown very quickly of the opportunity which I think he saw or the opportunity I think he missed. So there are two aspects. As you know, guys, me, my analysis is more well informed when it comes to taxi. But on the side of the bus and public transport, I'm trying to give you some reasonable analysis. So, yo bus that to sita in Yajugusha Linunua, from what I have done research, normally, inaingia at 7.5 million so hiyo inaitangwa la dead cost so meaning the pesa zenye zote ametumia from you know buying that car to buying the insurance to making the registration to paying to the sacco to join all the money yenye jugush amelipa ili hiyo gari hit the road ametumia 7.5 million kenya shillings so let us continue with the analysis normally Buses kama hizo ukizipeana kwa sako kama vile ameipeana super metro there is a wide range of money that the car owner is given by the driver together with the conductor and that money it ranges between 5000 to 10000 depending on the condition of the car kama ni gari mpya ama ni gari mzee na gari capacity yake ya kubeba kama gari yako iko around 52 seater normally huyo taxi driver huyo uh, sorry guys um <laughs> over you over used to to taxi so kama ni 52 bus capacity sitting capacity ya 52 that driver should be giving the car owner around 9 to 10000 so here jugush because ni 32 seater normally atakuwa akipewa between 6 to 8000 per day na hiyo ni siku yenye hiyo gari imeingia kazi so normally these drivers they work 6 days they rest one day and that one day is when that car goes to regular service ama iko na any mechanical check that is not emergency so it will be working for six days a week and assuming that haitawai pata accident assuming that haitawai pata mechanical breakdown ie dai kai garage for one week so if atakuwa keep minimum work na the lower side unajua always in business you try to estimate from the worst case scenario akipeangwa 6000 per day for 24 days a month because tumesema atakuwa hiyo gari kitakuwa ina work 6 days a week atapata an income of around 1.4 million no around uh, what is 144000 yes yes sorry so akilipango hizo 6000 per day for 24 days a month for 12 months In one month he will be making 144000 and then in one year atakuwa amepewa around 1.8 million. Tumeshika hiyo ndio gross income. Pesa yenye anapewa na driver wake. But remember hiyo pesa haitatolewa mafuta, haitatolewa anything but hizo pesa ndizo watafanyisha other services, ndio watabaya tire and other wear and tear stuff. So let us continue with the math. Tumeona at the end of the year Jugu shatakuwa ame pocket 1.8 million. But from my estimation ni kwamba 30% of the 1.8 million itatumika kwa maintenance of that car because in as much as driver anakupea his 6000 per day the only thing driver anafanya ni kuweka gari mafuta na pesa zake. But Jugu she had atatengeneza hiyo gari in case of service in case of anything so ni ka assume 30% of all the money that Jugu has pocketed atazitoa tena zikatengenezeshe gari just in case so 
Jugush itabidi ametoa around 550,000 towards the maintenance of that car meaning his net income will be around 1.2 so hapo najaribu kupeana rounded off figures so net profit ya Jugush will be 1.2 million per year tumeshika so meaning hii gari alikuwa made by 7.5 so how many years will it take before Jugush apart his break even it will take him around 6 years ili pesa yenye alilipa hiyo gari ikwe imerudi i assume kutoka mwaka wa sita hiyo gari lazima itakuwa kidogo imechapa chapa lakini the one the one fact about these buses ni kwamba zinakuanga na lifespan of 10 years before your gari has to pay some serious mechanical issues because much of these cars actually they are not ex japan or ex uk they are brand new they come zero mileage maybe from gm ama from isuzu ama from whichever brand easy buses zinabaya ngoa you know only the the driver's cabin na engine and then the body unatengenezesha so normally gari si kama hizi tunanunuanga ex japan so hii itakuja brand new zero mileage So after the sixth year Jugush atakuwa ame hit breakdown. And then mwaka wa saba, wa nane, wa tisa na wa kumi, atakula net profit of maybe one million per year because maybe that time service itakuwa imeongezeka, alafu maybe mechanical issues itakuwa zimeongezeka. So maybe the 1.2 he is making right now itakuwa imeenda chini to maybe one million. So for four years before that car to seme imefika sasa the last years of its life. On this other side what I was thinking is was it very wise for Jugush to invest in 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 in, uh, in uh, a bus what I think Jugush Jugush will do is this maybe atatumia hii gari for like three years unaona akishatumia hiyo gari for three years atakuwa ame make a net of 3.6 to si tumeshika ju tulisema ana make a net of 1.2 akitumia for three years at a make a net of 3.6 and then mwaka wa tatu ikifika auze hiyo gari na hiyo gari for sure ata user around 6 million because hizi gari has lose value vile zilikuwa zina lose kitambo in as much as economy itakuwa ina depreciate kuna inflation na nini hiyo gari ata user maybe 6 million na hii side ameshate tuseme hapo from what he bought atakuwa me lose 1.5 jua alikuwa may buy 7.5 sasa ame user 6 after three years but those three years he has made 3.6 so net profit yake itakuwa 2 million alafu achane na hiyo kazi ya gari and that is what so many people do even these people who taxi even myself you buy a taxi car you use it for one year it gives you some amount then you sell it at a small loss but unakuta at the end of it you have made some profit before your gari anze kukuletea shida but i had an alternative investment option for jugosh If he had decided to spend his 7.5 million on buying an Uber car. So 7.5 kusema ukweli 7.5 million angeenda Mombasa achukue Suzuki Altos na wholesale yuko hata atapewa around na, na maybe 650,000 ama 750,000 between that range. With 7.5 jugosha angechukua 10 Suzuki Altos angechukua 10 Suzuki Altos from my experience with Suzuki Alto ni kwamba every year a Suzuki Alto will give you a net income of of around um, 300,000 that is after you have deducted everything Suzuki Alto will give you 300,000 so if he had bought 10 Suzuki Altos kumaanisha pa ya jugush angekuwa ana make a net of 3 million a net of 3 million after deducting everything hizo suzuki alto singesema azitumie for 10 or 5 years azitumie just for 3 years okay atumie hizo suzuki alto just for 3 years tumeona pa hiyo zinampe 3 million akitumia for 3 years zitampe 9 million the 10 suzuki altos okay and then after the third year si, alikuwa amezinunua zote at 700,000 each After the third year because itakuwa ma KDP those are very still very new number plate after three years hapo 20 end of 2027 hizo Suzuki Alto i am sure Jugush atazuza zote at around 550 
tuseme alikuwa amezinunua 5 million no 77 700000 saizi attend as use kila moja 550 kumaanisha ata lose 150000 on each suzuki alto okay but each suzuki alto for 3 years itakuwa imempe 900000 do the math i don't want to finish that for you but jugush after 3 years with the bus atakuwa ame make around 2 million na jugush age by taxi after 3 years jugush age ku ame make 5.5 million that is my math 2 years 3 years with the bus jugush ata make 1. ata make 2 million 3 years with the taxi jugush age make 5.5 unaniuliza how age manage aje hizi taxi zote kumi i have an idea kuna fleet management companies they love new cars you bring for them kdps the first three years hamtasumbuana juizo gari hazina mechanical issues hazina nothing hazina nothing they will manage them very well for you then the moment hizo gari zishaanza kuchapa kutoka the third year unaziuza unaona you go get another bunch of 10 unazipeana huko so jugush nitafute nitafute surely this was a small mistake but you can redeem yourself in the next investment look for me